They don't need any introduction, do they, really? But he received her first and final rose this season of The Bachelorette. Please welcome the newly engaged couple, Rachel and Brian. <laughs> Get in those chairs, let's gossip. I love red, the color of love. Yes. 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 Uh, I love the roses. For, first of all, the fact that you can actually sit in public as a couple has got to be so relieving, yeah? It's so nice. Yeah. It's the little things that mean so much, you know? Yeah, we've had to keep this a secret for months now. Too long. I'm Aww. so happy that you got the final rose. <laughs> I really this am. Is so we heard you're so uh, excited. Uh, <laughs> I've never seen anything like it. I love this. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. So, I speak I don't, it, Ryan. Speak no, I don't it. Know, Preach it, Ryan. I don't know what you, I want to find out what you felt, but when I saw <laughs> the recap of all this last night, and you so confident with like, look, this is what I want. She's the one for me. I know this is meant to be, and if it's not me, if she doesn't pick me, it's not yeah. really meant to be. But I've put it all out there. Yep. I've been totally candid and honest, dude. That's when I like got emotional last we night. We need. Yeah. Make it happen. Yeah. Yeah. So let's when did you feel like you were on the right path? Because Peter was in your in your head for quite a lot of this. He was. And and to be honest, I've dated a lot of Peters. And that's what I kept telling him. He reminded me of my five year relationship. I'm used I've dated a lot of guys who didn't want to commit to me. You know, that's why I'm thirty two and was single. And for Brian, like for me when I really started to see it was when I had to defend him to my family. Mm -hmm. And I was explaining why he meant so much to me and who he was to me. And then I referred to him as my best friend. Aww. And that's when I was like, it's totally Brian. Yeah. So last yeah. night, yeah. <laughs> watching the show, yeah. you guys are engaged, OK? Yep. Then you're watching footage of her making out with Peter. <laughs> I was, yeah. like, concerned <laughs> for you because I, my blood was boiling. Like, and that, he's like a good kisser, too, bro. Like, <laughs> nice, good to know. Kissing mom and toes, Brian's like the to best call it. He's the best, but the, I mean, he's not bad at it. And so I'm watching, the thing. this has got to be, this has got to be, was it tough to watch that for you? Yeah, I mean, with all the guys, I mean, obviously it's a little strange yeah. to watch your fiance date 30 other guys. <laughs> um, but you know what, I'm, I'm mentally strong and I came into yeah. this whole process knowing that she was going to have relationships with other guys, deep connections, and maybe even love. But at the end of the day, I knew that she could only be in love with one man, and that was me. Aww. So. <laughs> I love this. It's amazing. Let me lean in. So you're, you're, you're sitting on the couch, Bridge, mm -hmm. and uh, so uh, Peter comes out, mm -hmm. right? It seemed like there was a little tension there. Well, with Peter, when he came out, because you hadn't spoken to each other in a while, right? Sips tea. And I was watching the show live with everyone else for the first time. So I'm seeing things that I either forgot or for the first time. So yeah, like it was frustrating to see where we were three months ago and like, how we were and the mind games that were being played and the push and the pull, it was frustrating. Like that was like the overall thing. And that's what you saw between Peter and I when, when I saw him again. And what did you say, Rachel, in the commercial break? Because you went to commercial break and I felt like- Brian knows everything about there, I, I, I felt like he wanted to lean in and say, Is, can we still give this a shot? I feel like he wanted to say that. He what didn't did he, say that. He did, what did he say? <laughs> he didn't say that. I think he wanted to say more, but he, we like were pulled away. We were separated. So honestly, I don't know. I don't know. Ooh. I'd love I don't to know. know what he wanted to say. When's the wedding? <laughs> and can uh, we come? Well, so you guys are definitely invited. Yes. Um, yes. She wants a winter wedding, so we're thinking, nothing set yet, uh, next December, yeah. maybe early January of 19. Let, let, let's come back and talk yeah. about the future of Rachel and Brian <laughs> right after this.